I'm David Tillman, author of NootropicsExpert.com, and in this video I'm going to share with you what I know about phosphatidylcholine as a nootropic, what it is, why we use it, the science behind it, dosage, and side effects. Phosphatidylcholine is one of two fatty acids that make up the outer layers of the membrane covering each of the seven trillion cells in your body. Phosphatidylcholine is also converted in your body through a process called hydrolysis, which make up the fatty acids AA, oleic, linoleic, linolenic, and DHA. These fatty acids contribute to the signaling within and between brain cells for long-term potentiation. LTP is the formation of long-term memories. The synthesis of the neurotransmitter acetylcholine is largely dependent on the choline provided by phosphatidylcholine. It is critical for cognition, learning, and memory. And when you don't have enough phosphatidylcholine, brain cell membranes lose integrity and eventually die. Now, some phosphatidylcholine is naturally synthesized in your body. We also get PC, it's also called PC, from some of our food, including beef, oysters, eggs, and some vegetables. Now, as a nootropic supplement, phosphatidylcholine is derived from lecithin found in soybeans and sunflower seeds. Now, note that lecithin and phosphatidylcholine are not the same thing. Plain lecithin is not an efficient source of phosphatidylcholine or choline. And as a nootropic, look for as pure of a source of phosphatidylcholine as you can afford. So let's dig in a little bit deeper. Phosphatidylcholine is a phospholipid that plays a critical role in every cell in your body, including your brain. Your brain cells are each encased in a membrane. This bilipid layer of two fatty acid tails face each other. The outer layer of each cell contains mostly the phospholipids, phosphatidylcholine, and spingomyelin, and the inner layer contains, predominantly, phosphatidylserine, which we'll be talking about in another video, phosphatidylinositol, and phosphatidylethylalamine. The outer layer of each of the cell membrane is highly permeable, but the inner layer is much less permeable. These two fatty acid tails are in a constant state of movement, vibrating at millions of times a second. This continual vibration could be considered as the backbone of life and as the basis of everything that happens in your brain. Now, the amount and type of long-chain fatty acids in your diet affects the composition of these cell membranes. The structure and function of your cells depend on the ideal balance of fats, including cholesterol, oleic, palmitic, and stearic fatty acids, and essential fatty acids like omega-3s. Uh, without this proper balance, cell membrane function is compromised. And you can be sure that our modern diet does not provide the ideal balance of fatty acids to maintain brain cell integrity, and it's why we experience brain fog, memory loss, slow thinking, and poor decision making. Now, some progressive health care pra practitioners and researchers have found that supplementing with phosphatidylcholine or PC can lessen the symptoms of diseases like MS, diabetes, immune system problems, asthma, and neurodegenerative diseases like Alzheimer's. Now you naturally get phosphatidylcholine from foods such as beef, eggs, oysters, broccoli, and Brussels sprouts. Supplemental phosphatidylcholine is made from lecithin found in soybeans and sunflower seeds. Phosphatidylcholine contain, maintains the integrity of brain cell membranes and is directly involved in acetylcholine synthesis. Acetylcholine is needed for cognition, learning, mem and memory formation. Well, first, phosphatidylcholine is needed for long-term memory. 
the hydrolysis of phosphatidylcholine is used to make many of the free fatty acids found in your cells, including DHA. These free fatty acids facilitate the synaptic tra transmission of, by targeting nicotinic receptor, acetylcholine receptors using protein kinase C, or PKC. This messenger system is needed for long-term potentiation. Now, researchers have determined that these fatty acids are critical for learning and memory. And second, phosphatidylcholine repairs neurons. Cholinergic neurons are unique among cells because they serve two functions. PC is a major component of brain cell membranes and serves as a storage tool for the choline needed as a precursor for acetylcholine synthesis. Now, researchers demonstrated how this works. They incubated human cholinergic cells in the lab. And they followed the metabolic link between the membrane composition and turnover and acetylcholine synthesis and proved that acetylcholine is synthesized from choline derived from the degradation of phosphatidylcholine. If there is not enough choline available to maintain brain cell membrane integrity and to synthesize the neurotransmitter acetylcholine, brain cell function breaks down you experience brain fog, poor memory, and decision-making, and ultimately leading to neurodegenerative diseases like Alzheimer's and other motor neuron disorders. Phosphatidylcholine has been around as long as humans have walked this planet. It is a critical component of the top layer of the membrane surrounding each of the cells in your body. And yet some are talking about phosphatidylcholine as the new wonder drug. Now, how could that be? Well, it turns out that phosphatidylcholine is a fatty acid, as are many of the fats we consume in our modern diet. Now, long-chain fatty acids affect the composition of our cell membranes, and when we eat bad fats, our cell membrane fluidity is affected. Ion channels are disrupted, hormones, regulation of neuroreceptors, signaling, and other signaling chemicals are affected. Incorrect amounts of or types of long-chain fatty acids can lead to a cascade of serious health and cognition problems. Now, the easiest and simplest way to correct many of these cognition problems is to supplement with phosphatidylcholine as a nootropic. You'll feel better as cells are repaired. Digestion issues could be eliminated or minimized, and brain fog, cognition, memory problems could be a non-issue. If you eat a perfectly healthy diet and are in optimal physical and mental health, using phosphatidylcholine may not do anything for you. But if you're like most in this society, relying on fast food, processed food, and other unhealthy lifestyle habits, then phosphatidylcholine may help. Now, neurohackers report that supplementing with phosphatidylcholine lifts brain fog, it improves working memory, and it boosts alertness. Others say it helps to prevent anxiety and panic attacks. Mental clarity is improved, and energy levels rise. Ray Kurzweil, the famous inventor and futurist, gets his phosphatidylcholine intravenously once a week at his health clinic. His theory is that this will regenerate all of his body's tissues. A double-blind study in California with 80 college students investigated the effects of phosphatidylcholine on memory. The students received a placebo or either 10 or 25 grams of phosphatidylcholine. Now, 25 grams of PC was estimated to supply about 3.75 grams of choline. Memory was tested at 60 and 90 minutes after taking PC. The researchers recorded a significant improvement in memory after 90 minutes, and only a slight improvement after 60 minutes. This 1993 study was the first to test the relationship between a single dose 
of phosphatidylcholine on memory in healthy human subjects. Now I've got more research over on Nootropics Expert. So just go to this article on um, nootropicsexpert.com, search for phosphatidylcholine or click on the link below this video. I've got another study that shows how phosphatidylcholine prevents brain cell death. And I've got another detailed study on how phosphatidylcholine improves memory. Recommended phosphatidylcholine dosage is 1200 milligrams or up to 5 grams per day. And divide your, your daily dose into two or three equal doses in dose throughout the day. To, uh, to enhance bioavailability and boost absorption, take your phosphatidylcholine 30 minutes before a meal. And do not take phosphatidylcholine with an acetylcholinesterase inhibitor since this combination may excessively increase acetylcholine levels that can potentially cause cholinergic side effects. Acetylcholinesterase inhibitors like Aricept, Cognex, and uh, the nootropic Uprazine A. Phosphatidylcholine is naturally produced in your body and is considered well tolerated and safe. It is not toxic. Now some may experience uh, sweating, stomach upset, and diarrhea, particularly if you're already high in choline. Phosphatidylcholine is sold in tablet, capsule, liquid, and powder form. Capsules can run from 420 to 1300 milligrams each. And the 500 milligrams of phosphatidylcholine in powder form is equivalent to two level, one eighth of a teaspoon scoops. You usually get a little scoop that comes in the powder. Uh, phosphatidylcholine is sometimes used interchangeably with lecithin although the two are different. Choline is a component of phosphatidylcholine and it is also a component of lecithin. Although they're closely related, these two are not the same. So the bottom line is when you're looking for a supplement, don't assume that you're going to get phosphatidylcholine by taking lecithin because you're not. So my nootropics expert recommendation for phosphatidylcholine is 1200 milligrams to 5 grams per day. And that's my report on phosphatidylcholine. If you want to see links to the studies I talked about, go to nootropicsexpert.com and search for phosphatidylcholine or click on the link below this video. There you'll find a full transcript of this video and you'll find dozens of articles on all the well-known nootropics on Nootropics Expert. If you have any questions or you want to share your experience using phosphatidylcholine, please use the comments section at the bottom of the post on nootropicsexpert.com. I respond to comments and questions at Nootropics Expert usually the same day. Now, if you want to see more videos and all the best nootropics used today, subscribe to this channel before you leave. I'll be putting up new videos on nootropics and optimizing your brain every week. I'm David Toman, author of Nootropics Expert.